Did I get it? <laughs> Did I get it? That's the question here. Okay. <clears throat> Hi, everybody. Dark Sapphire 117 here. And I have been going through my Steam library and just kind of, yeah, going through games that I've meant to touch, haven't touched in ages. And uh, here we are. I've I've uh, finally installed Sword and Sorcery for the I don't know how manyth time, and I've finally booted it up. Now, by by the the little percentage bar down there, I I booted it, and yeah, I, I've been testing some games out for the past couple of hours, and uh, yeah. Yeah, I didn't like them, or it, they just didn't click with me. Uh, like Craft the World, um, it, it's it's a really good gaming concept, but I I I'm picky about my crafting games. I like Terraria. I like Minecraft. I like Seven Days to Die. Um, Craft the World, you know, see, seemed into in more in the Terraria vein, and it looks it, it looks really interesting. The visuals are nice, the graphics are nice, everything runs smoothly. Um, but it the tutorial is a pain in the ass for me. It tells you you know how like vaguely vague instructions on how to build your shelter, but you need certain walls and you need certain uh, materials. I'm guessing, and you have to master skills before you can reach the point where you need to, where you can get your shelter set up with your totem mask thing that helps protect your cargo and stuff and i wasn't fond of you know quest one uh taking two hours and requiring a lot of sidetrack missions or sidetrack um uh, 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 goals, yeah, goals, you know, building blocks in order to reach that. It's very, it's very, I don't know, it wasn't, instructions not clear, and I wound up look, having to look on a wiki to figure out how the world I'm supposed to build the shelter and get it upright, and I'm just like, eh, if I'm spending an hour or two and I have to go to a wiki to figure out what I need to do just to do step one, build a house. I'm not, I'm not particularly interested in sticking with that because my patience for crafting games is, oddly enough, very thin, and yet I still enjoy playing them. I'm weird. Anyways, back to this. Uh, Sword and Sorcery. I, I don't really know what it's about, but I, uh, I started playing it for. You know, a few seconds until I got the uh, the movement control figured out. And I'm like, oh, this is really interesting. It's got a really nice soundtrack and beautiful graphics. Very unique. I, I enjoy it so far. And I figured I'd go ahead and stream it. Might be interesting for you guys to watch. I don't know. Oh, did, 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 the, did the sound die? Oh no, my desktop sound isn't working. Why do I have no desktop audio? Hang on. Oh my god, I broke my desktop audio. Okay. Technical difficulties. Everything was fine. Two minutes ago. I'm gonna reboot the aim. How about that? How about we do that? That sounds good. Oh, that's why I don't have desktop idea. Ha! Ha ha ha! My headphones came unplugged. That's a problem, isn't it? And if I plug in my headphones, my mouse stops working. What the fuck?
Okay. What's going on? Everything is breaking. Oh no. Oh no. Go away. Stop. What is this? Help? I think I fixed it. Maybe. Let me reboot Steam. How about that? I'm definitely prepared for the stream, I swear. I had plans and I prepared and I set everything up beforehand, I swear. This was- everything was fine. <laughs> everything was fine. There we go. Okay. Turn on the volume just a little bit. There we go. Got it! <laughs> now hopefully the stream isn't broken. I'm going to assume that it's not. It's not. Look. What is this? What is this? Ah, what was that? What is this? Oh. Okay. I'm gonna walk to the puppy. Hello, puppy. The walking mechanic is very strange. I have to press and hold and wait for the dial to show up. It's very interesting. And the visuals are beautiful. It's 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 a more unique style. I like it. Ah, oh, there we go. Word from the ravaged steppes of Scythia. We met a dark haired girl in a sunlit meadow. To the mountain folk of the Caucasus, he was known as Girl and she seemed nice. Well, that's not original. Well, I don't want to tip tap on the gate and go somewhere else if there is a doggy that wants me to follow. Who is Doggy? What does Doggy want? Doggy wants to go into the woods. Okay, let's go check out the building. I'm not gonna go that way quite yet. In the meadow, there was an immovable iron gate blocking a cavernous cave. Okay! I can't go that way anyways. We spied a few worthless sheep lazing around the meadow. Sheep are not worthless! Alright, that's food! That's fur! That's, that's, uh, wool.
wool keeps you warm. Zoom? Ah! Zooming. That's beautiful visuals. Home is where the hearth is. Hearth? Hearth? I've heard it pronounced both ways. Hearth. Inside the hut, we spied a little round something or other above the hearth. Ab above the hearth. I'm not dyslexic. I swear. Inside the hut, the hearth was quietly cracking, crackling with familiar warmth. Nice place. Morning. Morning. You say more than just random noises. The wood chopping woodsman chopped wood. Okay. The mount to the mountain folk of the Caucasus. He was known as Logfella, and he seemed cool. <laughs> Logfellow knew all about our woeful errand, and he agreed to lead us up the old road. Still, we definitely got the feeling that he wasn't super jazzed about this. <laughs> I like this. This has charm. This has a lot of charm to it. We are right there, Logfellow? Hello. Buddy! The woodsman waited for us to continue along the path to start off to, to the start of the old room. God, I can read today, I swear I can. Can I just poke all the bushes, or is it just this one? Meh. We spied a curious looking nest box with an inscription that read, Tweet and ye shall be retweeted. <laughs> That's cute, because you can set up a, a Twitter account. I'm not entirely sure what, inter what that integration entails, but... The woodsman confirmed 100% that he had the only key to the locked door in the stone wall. Okay. See, you have the option to tweet. I do not have a Twitter- well, actually, I do have a Twitter, but I don't ever use it, and it's... I don't know. It, it's, it's probably non-existent by now. It's been years since I actually made a Twitter. <laughs> or used it. It was a really nice-looking key. We were totally ready to just tap and hold on the path ahead to move it, move it, move it. <laughs> Oh. Hey. Hey! I'll be right back. Don't worry about it. Ah, oh, there's a way up there. Okay. Is there anything that's gonna jump out over here? Nope. Okay. That is pretty pointless then. Tip -a -tip -a -tip -a -tip. What does the black say? <clears throat> Sk 
Scythia, Chimeria, Samaria, Chimeria, Chimeria, Assyria, and Persia. These are all the kingdoms of men. Mingi Tal is the kingdom of the cloud. I hope I'm saying these right. This sounds like real places. I I understand Persia. Uh, 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 uh. There's only certain I, bits I of history and uh, world knowledge I have. Only certain places. Get some music picked up here. Alright, I'm okay with this. Stride a log bridge on the little roads with grim flagpole adorned with lucky looking skulls. Okay, I don't want to I'm down there. No, I don't want to click. Oh boy. It's a three eyed. Dire wolf? The woodsman had seen some kind of creepy monster thing, and he figured he'd just let us handle it. How nice of you, NPC log fella. Pat the doggo. By the side of the old road, there was a stone carved with a pair of glyphs in the shape of a sword and shield. Okay. Let's go. Let's see if I die. <laughs> Fight. Yes. How how do I how do I fight thing? Oh. 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 No. How do I hit the thing? Oh, again. Uh, hitting it? I don't know if I'm hitting it or not. Oh boy. Oh boy. How do I kill it? Oh god, please get off. What if I just do this? Okay. It seems like I can't actually hit the thing for some reason. No, where are you going? I wasn't done kicking your ass. But sort of understanding it. I don't understand the attacking aspect of it. We'll figure it out. We spied a collection of graves in a thicket to the side of the old road, and we wondered what was up with that. I mean, some people died. That's what happened. I like the bushes. This game's pretty. Hey, there's a 
thing down here. It's the thing down here. Sir. Log fella. I want to know what this is. On a side path leading away from the old road was a stone carved with a series of indecipherable glyphs. Useful. Amid the indecipherable glyphs, we spied a series of lunar pictograms. Okay. And it's locked the door hid in the forest underbrush below the old road that leads up to Mingy Tall. Okay. I'm coming. We spied a withered looking nest box that looked kind of like a face in a creepy way. It looks sad. <laughs> I had a solitary grave at the edge of the perilous pre precipice. I wondered what was up with that. I'm wondering a lot about what's up with graves. The answer is people died. At the perilous precipice was a huge rock-hewn sculpture of a familiar-looking head with a mouth agape. Is it the mouth of the log fella? He has ears. Also, there's a flagpole on top of it. I like the rainbow. It's so cool! I love the graphics of this. It's so pretty! So pretty! To one side of the perilous precipice stood a wonder- a wondrous dolmen-looking- dolmen thing that sheltered two comfortable-looking stone seats. Can we sit in it? Yes, we can. How comfortable. Alright, let's go. Yes. I see that. And you're just gonna sit down. The woodsman known as Logfella had chosen to chill out beneath the stone shelter near the perilous precipice. Logfella seemed to know all about the loathsome rainbow and the nearby loathsome rainbow. Do you not like colors, person? And the nearby glyph depicting the skyward sword. And yet Logfella offered zero help about what to do next, which kind of rubbed us the wrong way if we're being totally honest. I agree. Pet the puppy. What if I just sit here with you and then we get nothing done? You know, you don't really have much to say either. Uh, huh? That's cool. Uh, we can. Uh, why don't we just? Why don't we just enjoy the quiet? Okay. Pretty nice atmosphere. Sound quality is pretty good. It's uh, pretty foresty with all the birds and the trees and the loathsome rainbow. Mm -hmm. Hey. Yep. Yep. <clears throat> You're kind of crap, dude. You're 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 a pretty crap guy. Thanks. At the edge of the perilous precipice, a stone carved with the glyph of a skyward sword beneath the colors of a rainbow. We Scythians loathe the rainbows.
unsheath. Yes. Da -da -da -da. Ugh. I won't walk on that. Wait. We had bridged the chasm and we felt super smart. We told Logfella that we thought of that we sought a burdensome book of sinister sorcery known as the Megatome. The Megatome lurked somewhere in the haunted darkness beyond the perilous precipice beneath Mingy Tall. We, we resolved to get the, the Megatome and then get out alive. Wow, I can't read. I'm sorry. <laughs> okay. You're... 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 you're real helpful, bro. Let's... go! Are they not coming? Hello? Why are you sitting back down? Do you not care? Sir? Log fella? Uh, what do you think about blood sports? Everyone likes blood sports, right? Eh. I, I heard that uh, they're, they're building a place downtown. Um, some kind of uh, place to see people get killed by animals, beasts, and stuff. That sounds neat. Listen, like, no, not really. I mean, I wouldn't want my dog to be forced to kill people. If, uh, doggo over here, if dog fella, nah, no, 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 yeah, yeah, dog fella. If, uh, dog fella didn't want to Kill things. Weirdo. Blood sports aren't that great, man. <clears throat> Are they just not following anymore? He's just gonna sit there. It is my dog, isn't it? Or is it his dog? I don't know. I like the dog and I'm claiming it as mine. Trespass. Astride a rickety bridge stood a grim pole creepily adorned with an antlered skull. Okay. And apparently I'm trespassing? Here we go. Oh, hello there. Are you a statue? In a subterranean corridor, we spied an ominous statue, but we didn't worry too much about it. You say we. Does the we mean you and me, or you and the dog? Because we're not following. Three ways to go. Let's go left. Sword and sorcery. Interesting. I think. Um, give me just one thing. Thank you. 
Sorry about that. Uh, deep within the mountain temple, above a tall passageway, we spy three strange triangular shapes. It's the Triforce. So this, one of these, is probably the gate to where we came from. Okay. Center. Nope, not going to comment on that one. Okay. Uh, windows? Doors? Are these, are these ways to go? Yes, they are. It's helpful. Okay. What is this? <sighs> we found the megatone clasped in two bone hands. We felt our sword stir in its sheath. Did it let go, or did I successfully... I'm spooked. This goal was too easy. I have the Megatome. And now I'm destroying the world, right? That's how this works, right? Oh boy. Uh, time to run. Time to go. I'm not gonna go like that. No, sir. Not interested. I I do not want what you're selling. Nope. Do not want. I'm not interested in the things you are selling. I am not interested in your sample packs. Uh, I will not give you my email address. Nope, don't want it. Goodbye. That's, that, that statue's going to attack me, isn't it? No? Oh god. Oh no. I'm not interested. I don't want your sample packs. I found Jesus, thank you very much. Oh god. Well, now 
I think. Did I actually kill the thing? I don't think I actually killed the thing. I think I just killed the statue. But the statue was still standing. I don't know. Huh? Hello! Rainbow's gone. How's hey. it going? Dude, you know smoking's bad for you, right? We had a tree of the Megatome, and Logfellow was 100% ready to move it, move it, move it to the safety of his lodgings. We sensed a gathering thunderstorm, and yet a little song began in our heart. I'm just waiting for me to go through it. I think the music. <laughs> we spied a pile of chopped firewood. No big deal. <clears throat> hey, I'm coming. I guess the doggo is his, huh? In the light of the gathering storm, Logfella admitted that he had a serious case of the heebie-jeebies right about now. Was Logfella intentionally freaking us out? In any case, it was probably totally safe just to, to just take shelter for a bit. I mean, yeah, probably. 
can't hurt. Well, hello, person. Are you love fellas, lady friend? Hey, it's the record thing from the uh, menu. Make a and you're the smartest. So you've awoken the deathless specter who slumbered in the darkness between Minky Tall. Yikes. Consequently, a sinister thunderstorm looms and the lonely people who live in the stone hut are a little heartbroken. The, ups the upshot is that you got the burdensome book known as the Megatome. In our next session, we will discuss its strange purpose. Our research shows that prolonged exposure to the myth Mythopoetic psycho. Oh my gosh. Words today. The mythopoetic psychocosmology of sword and sorcery EP can have adverse side effects, like not being able to read, because that's what's happening. So now that you've completed session one, how's about we take a little break? I'll be right here when you're ready for session two. That actually sounds like a pretty good idea. Uh, I've been, I don't know how long I've been streaming for, probably about a half hour now, including the technical difficulties. Uh, I will probably go ahead and cut it here, because I have, I have to, uh, get out of here soon. 17%, okay, so we've got, got about five or six sessions, huh? Not bad. Uh, hey, how's it going? Wanna jam? Good. Let's rock. Hi. Are we rocking? I, I like the voice acting in this. It's it's so it's quiet and it's the style of this game is quiet and very atmospheric and God, I like it. I really like it. It's a very unique game uh, compared to all the other things that I've played. Anyways, I'm gonna go ahead and end it here, and uh, I will have to pick this back up at a later time, most definitely. I really want, I really want to finish this game out. Thank you for watching. See you later.